So ChatGPT just got a new feature that lets you branch a conversation. Essentially, you can split a discussion into multiple different chats, but of course, the original thread won't be deleted, so you can always go back and then continue from that point on. Now, I'm going to show you how you can actually use this feature and some other caveats that you need to know. So this is one example that I created. This is the original thread and I basically sent a message to ChatGPT that I want to get some suggestion for a marketing copy that I could use for this particular product. And also on the second message, I sent this, me I sent this uh, prompt. Basically, I want to get the a suggestion of a text that I can insert into the poster. Now, let's take a look at the branch version. This is the one that I have created from that particular thread. And as you can see, it looked quite the same, except if you scroll down, the second message was different. So on the original thread, the second message was, please suggest some text I can insert into the poster. But on the branch version, I asked the GPT to modify the answer, this answer, to sound more playful. So it was very different. And not to mention, there is this label telling you that uh, this is not the original thread. This is something that was coming out of this particular thread. So you can actually go back and maybe continue the conversation again, or maybe uh, create another branch, or perhaps you can even create a branch from, from the branch that you created. So let me show you how you can actually use this feature, the branching feature from ChatGPT. First, and this is very important, go to chatgpt.com and then log in with your account. So right now, when I'm recording this video, this feature is still limited to anyone that is logging to their ChatGPT account and also the web version of ChatGPT. So it is not yet available on the desktop and mobile app version of ChatGPT, but I believe eventually everyone can start enjoying this new feature. Okay, now let me send a simple message. Please suggest some gears that I could get to start a YouTube channel. Okay, that's gonna be the topic. Just send a message. And by the way, I was using a sort of you know, speech to text tool on my computer that's able to convert my voice into text. You can check it out on the description if you are interested to use that. Now, uh, I got this answer from ChatGPT. Okay, there's plenty of uh, options and let's send some other messages. Can you suggest budget lighting that I could purchase right now? So here, I just want to get a suggestion about the lighting, but I will show you uh, I will create another branch where it's going to be talking only about microphone. Okay, so this is the answer from ChatGPT. This is the second answer. Now, to branch a conversation, you can click, you can take a look at the answer. You can scroll down a bit, and then you can click this icon, that three-dot icon that says more actions, and then click branch a new chat. And by the way, you can uh, see that icon on every answer from ChatGPT. So that will indicate where you want to start branching out the conversation. So in this case, I will start branching out from the first answer from ChatGPT. So click this and then click branch and new chat. <clears throat> so basically it will open a new page or start a new thread, but of course this is a branch, this is not the original thread anymore. And as you can see, there's only one answer. There is only the topic about some gears that I could use for a YouTube channel and there is no talking about the lighting because that's exactly the thing that I created on the uh, first or the original thread but it wasn't something that is shown when you create a branch before you start that particular topic now in this case on the second iteration on the second branch I'm going to uh, you know specify maybe I want to get to know more about hey please suggest some microphone that I could use right now. So the first one was talking about lighting and then the second one that this new branch is talking about microphones. So that's maybe one benefit of using a branching feature from ChatGPT where on the original thread you can talk about something, on the branch you can talk about a different thing. And of course, again, you can create as many branches as you like and you can also create a branch from the branch that you created. So it is something that you can do and maybe it's going to help you work much more efficient with ChatGPT. So that's basically everything that you need to know about the new branching feature from ChatGPT and some limitations that you need to be aware of. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video. I wish you a great day ahead.